I've been working on the Credo project, which is a climate resilience demonstrator. Now, what this project's been aiming to do is to build a digital twin of the UK infrastructure networks and then model how future environmental catastrophes could impact on that network. The way we've been going around doing this is we've been working with the different asset owners, such as partners in the telecommunications network or in the energy networks, and then we've been trying to build a representation of this infrastructure that we can use to analyse these future impacts. The great work that we've been able to do as the Hartree Centre between industry and academia, we've been able to work with both, take the knowledge that both parts have and use our software developing expertise to put this into a real functioning digital twin. Credo shines a light on those interconnected parts between the networks to understand in a flood scenario, for instance, what those failure modes could be cascading across networks. We've been using climate projections and then we've been using flood models to predict where we think different climate projections will result in floods in different locations. Each individual asset owner doesn't have access to all this data but by bringing them together and building this digital twin of all the networks, we can start looking at how, say, a failure in a power network propagates to the telecommunications network or to the water network, and then we can really get a picture of how these future environmental conditions could impact our resilience in our infrastructure networks. We're working with the energy sector and the water sector to develop the technologies of the future which will enable us to manage these complex infrastructure systems. 